Hi, this is Tina Hughes from buildawebsitetonight.com. In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to find the email settings and configuration after you've created um, a hosting account using cPanel with us. Okay, I'm going to log into an account and we'll have a look at the settings. When you first log into your cPanel um, area, your hosting account, you can see different sections, there's mail, files, log, security and you can actually grab the title of one section and move it up or down depending on what it is that you would like to do. Now for today's exercise we're just having a look at the email accounts so if I click on email accounts it takes me to a new window where you can set up new email accounts or if you scroll further down the screen you'll see email accounts that have already been created. Now I've set up a fake website mydummywebsiteaccount.com and I've created an email name sample.email. Now to the right of this email name you will see uh, an icon where you can access webmail so that you don't need an Outlook client or any other client you can just click this and go to your email account online. Now uh, over here we have four icons, delete, if you want to delete your email name, change the quota, change the password and configure the mail client. What we're looking at today is configure the mail client. So let's click on that. You're taken to a new page where you can see all different names for and versions of software. So depending on what you have already installed on your computer, you might have a Macintosh, so there's Mac Mail down here, and there's Microsoft Outlook up here, whether you've got Express or Two, depending on whether you've got Pop3 or whatever you are normally using on your desktop. So let's let's just click on the first one and have a look. Uh, this uh, the message I'm seeing here is this will automatically install the proper mail setting for Microsoft Outlook. So I'm just going to escape out of that one for the moment. But what I'm going to do is scroll further down the page so that I can show you the actual settings, the manual settings that you can put into your own software account. Okay, at the bottom of the screen here, you'll see a heading manual settings. So there's the username, the um, mail protocols, POP3, SMTP, all of the settings that you would need for your local email software that you might have installed on your, your computer. So if you're someone who's okay to play with those settings, then go ahead and use those. Otherwise, these items up here will auto-configure whichever software you're using on your computer. So it will be all automated. Okay, I hope you found this interesting. I hope this helps. And I look forward to being in touch again soon. This is Tina Hughes saying goodbye from buildawebsitetonight.com.